write 6 times 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 6 in exponential in exponential notation. So what's going on over here? Well, we have 6 multiplied by itself how many times? Let's see, that's 6 times 1. Then 6 times 2 is that. That's 6 times, well, it's not 6 times 2. It's 6 times itself 2 times. Remember, 6 times itself 2 times would be 36. 6 times 2 would only be 12. So we have 1, 6, 2, 6, 3, 6, 4, 6, 5, 6s, 6, 6s, six, 7, 6s, Eight sixes. So we're multiplying six by itself eight times. To write this in exponential notation, we would say that this is equal to six. This is equal to six to the to the eighth power, which is literally equal to six times 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 six. Now I want to make it very clear: this is not. This is not. This is not equal to 6 times 8. 6 times 8. 6 times 8 will only be 48. 6 to the 8th power is a super huge number. 6 times 6 is 36. Then you're going to multiply that times 6, which is what? That's like 36 times, that's what, 216. And then you keep multiplying it by 6, you get some huge number here. This number right here, it, it's worthwhile to point out. This number is huge. This number is huge. This number right here, not so huge. It is not huge. So don't get confused. If you see 6 to the 8th power, it's 6 times itself 8 times, not 6 times 8.